All right, everyone, welcome back to the channel and welcome to NFT Spastic Plastic, Fantastic Plastic. Um, we're going to do some pack rolls. I'll talk about it. Sorry for the voice. <clears throat> but uh, I, I don't know what to think of this release. I think it's a little lackluster. Um, ugh, I don't know. Uh, I didn't love it, but I played in it just to really, you know, open some packs, have a little fun with it. Um, very underwhelmed by, I thought, the cards and uh, the set in general. Just, uh, to me, very, very underwhelming. You let me know what you think, and uh, let's get some information and enjoy this pack roll video. All right, here we go. Fantastic plastic, and yes, the voice is better. How about that? So here it is. This is how it looked um, when you did it and all that good stuff. Sugar Bomb, your grail, $9.99. I don't uh, have much words for that. Uh, Juan Calavera. I mean, cool. You know, eh. Fair. Uh, this is the nicest one, I think, Carl. I mean, it's cool. I like that. And then your royalty is Freddy Funko, as I forget the character, but he's all over the place. Glow in the dark. Glow in the dark. So the first one since Zombie Halloween to be glow in the dark. So not bad. Um, I think a little too many packs. Just my opinion. You know, I think it's just a little too many packs. But we do have some here to open up. We got some standard packs. I think we bought two premium. Interesting thing about this set was, guys... It took the original of $60 and raised it to $120. And normally you get, um, it, it ends at 5 o'clock. They kept this set going all the way till 9 p.m. 9 p.m. Now, the question you're going to ask is, did they still, did they sell out running for extra hours? Well, stay tuned and I'll show you that uh, in information. Um, yeah. So, here we go. I mean, eh, these are decent. You know, these are decent. Not bad. And there you see some cool ones. I mean, there's an Epic, Oodles, you know, there's Gil. Um, there's whatever the character's name is. I don't know. Um, I, I think, honestly, this set to me is a little lazy doing, like, these different, these colors there. There's Luther, again, has been done. Rocco Billy has been done. Um, you know, I, I don't really like these. I think it's kind of stupid. I don't, I don't know. It doesn't work for me. There's Gil, the same thing. I, I don't get it. I, I think overall the animations, the designs and everything, I mean, to me at least, pretty lackluster. Um, <clears throat> you know, Fantastic Plastic is a tremendous. There's another one that's been done. A tremendous set, you know what I mean, as far as the arts about them. But um, when you're talking value and things like that, they've never been, quote unquote, the most valuable type of Funkos that have been created. They don't have great value to them. There's Oodles, there's Sugar Bomb, um, you know. And going through, I don't, you know, we're just trying to build the set. I, I think... Uh, and we did look at costs, and I think I, I put that later in the video here where, you know, it'll show you what sort of the updated costs of these items are. And, you know, to be quite honest, they're not that valuable. I um, mean, you can go buy these legendaries. I think, like, Carl, which I think is the best one. There he is. I think it, he was, like, 25 26 bucks. 26 um, Very inexpensive. Again, the resale value on uh, Fantastic Plastic, Spastic Plastic has never been great. Never. I mean, there's a 500-piece one that's, you know, kind of rare and does have some value to it. But, uh, yeah. I mean, not really hitting anything. Um, you know, eventually put the set together. And, uh, you know, not outrageous to put the set together. You know, Epics, I think we're in the 6, 7 range, 5 range, depending. So, you know, not bad there. There's an Epic Rocco Billy. Um... I don't know. I wanted to like the set, guys. I really did. But, uh, you know, it was just, it was tough. It was tough. And here we go. A little premium action here. 
there's Pulpo. I think I've done to him before. Luther, which I I, did, I like him. I think I have the Luther pop. Very, very cool. Carl might be one I even buy, you know. Uh, Oodles, loved Oodles. I think it's great, you know. Um, but yeah, these are just, I don't know. Couldn't get with them. I really hate the, the, the different, you know, the, the color like that and the red. I, I don't, it just does not do much for me. But there it is. We finish it up. Um, we'll go here and look at the inventory and see how we did. Want to move it over to Redemption Tracker. And, uh, you know, all these packs, we're at 63.3% of the of the, uh, of the set. You know, um, 17 out of 19 uncommon, uh, 7 out of 14 rares. And we did get 5 out of 12 on the epics, which are always the more expensive ones. These prices uh, on uh, drop are, are not very accurate. Um, so keep that in mind. So well. here it is. There's Carl, $24.02. And this literally, guys, is like the next day. So might only go going down. But yeah, $24.02 for Carl. Almost a no-brainer to buy him. Maybe even wait him out. Maybe he's even comes in at less than 20 eventually. I I don't know. Not a great. Uh, here's the other one, um, $31.11. Again, more than likely could be under 20 right now, or under 30. Um, cool pop, but again, <clears throat> like I've said, if, if you look at Hobby DB and the history of these fantastic plastic, the value is not there. The dollar amount is not there on these things. They just, they're not. It's just the way that, uh, that it is. Um, but yeah, 31 might be un under 30. Uh, currently right now so you got that and then here's your grail 151 again might get down to the 120 range maybe less if you're looking for it um my advice is if you want them just buy them um i'd play the long game on this the grail but i think eventually you're, you could very well get carl for maybe under 20 uh the other one maybe in the 25 range and there's you know say 50 bucks for two legendaries it's cheaper than buying two packs where you could get nothing. So it makes a lot of sense just to just go buy it. Um, that would be my, uh, and, and put the whole set together if that's what you want as well. So here's, like I said, they let this go until normally they close at six uh, Eastern. They closed at nine Eastern, an extra three hours, not to mention an extra $120 per transaction, which they've only limited it to 60 previous sometimes they open it up later on in the drop so they already knew i think they were in trouble with this drop uh and you would think if they did the extra like five four hours would they sell out well the answer to that is no Fifteen thousand piece each you know each thousand packs each you burned almost eight thousand standard and 5300 premium um which I would probably say is not a good thing. Um, I would call that uh, a loss in my mind. Not a win. Not a great series. Too many packs. Should have probably been maybe even 10,000 on this. You know, just saying. Even like that might not have sold out. But anyway, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Um, we'll catch you on the next drop. Maybe. Not sold on that one. Be well, be safe. I'm the Luau. Peace out, guys.